this video is going to explain how to make a washer using SOLIDWORKS. After you start SOLIDWORKS, you can click on this and click on new. You may have this window pop up. How to start, you, you may not have one. If you don't have one, just click on here and bring one. Click on part, click on OK. Once you are in the solid, solid works, the first step is to check whether the sketch is highlighted. If not, click. Now you can use a circle command here to draw a washer in 2D first. Click on the reference plane and move your mouse to the center. Click and release the mouse and drag it away. Click. Now you can enter the dimension. Put 25 here. Then you can move to the center again to create a second circle. Click. And click. Now I put 14 here. Right. So we now finish the 2D sketch, then we can click on the front plane, we're back to the front plane. So we can move to the features, click on the extent, both or base command. Now you're in the 3D, we need to define the directions. And we start to do the protrusion from mid plane. Click. And we enter the thickness of the washer 1.2. Press return. Now we have a 3D washer here. You click on the green tick, we have a 3D part. Now we can add chamfers here. I click the chamfer command and click on one of the edge. And now you can define the dimension of chamfer. For example, I put a point two here and press return. I move to the other edge and add more edges in until all the chamfers are applied. Then I can click on good tick. Then we have the washer with the chamfers. Now you can save your file. All right. Uh, washer onto your hard disk. That's it for this video.